hey guys welcome back so guys in this video we are going to start with new topic that is laravel 9 e-commerce okay so we will be using live wire 2 with this laravel 9 to build the e-commerce so first we will be seeing with the installation of laravel live wire and database connection so guys now let's get started as simple guys let's go to the laravel doc documentation and the live wire documentation okay let's begin with creating the laravel project via composer so here we come to the installation and install via composer let's click on it and here is a command to create the project so let's copy this guys and i have already opened one folder called laravel and now let's open the terminal so i'm going to use git bash so now guys let's copy the code once again the command so here you copy and paste that paste so here your project name starts like lara e-commerce hit enter so it starts with the installation part okay so let's wait guys until it gets installed so guys the application is successfully installed and now let's close this and now let's open the project in our editor so I'm using VS Code Editor guys. And now guys, let's serve this application and check the output. So you can start from your git bash. Now guys, you make sure you call your correct path over here. So my project application path is called correctly. And now let's serve this application, PHP Artisan serve hit enter application started so you can go to the local host 8000 and here your application comes so it's laravel 9 version guys over here as simple and now guys let's install with the live wire so you need to go to your live wire documentation and quick start here let's move it install live wire let's copy this code copy and make sure you are installing in your project itself okay i mean to tell call your correct path and now you can paste the code and install that live wire let's wait guys until it gets installed so our live wire is successfully installed and now if you see there is no difference application is served here we see the refresh everything works fine guys and now you just need to configure some setups okay so live wire setup we have to do go to the doc and here you see you have to include the javascript whatever it is given of live wire okay so one is styles and one is scripts so make sure whenever you are using any live wire component you have to include in your main file that means you have to go to your resource views and wherever you are using the HTML tag inside that head tag you have to use it okay like this so we are not going to use here why because we are in the welcome blade and we'll be seeing in next video about that authentication from that we get a app blade file okay and in that only we will set up this live wire yep guys and now let's set up the database connectivity so let's go to dot env file and move to your database so i have already created one database called e-commerce let's copy that and set it here so this is our database connectivity here root and password is null itself and the project name you can keep as laravel e-commerce let's keep inside the double quotes laravel e-commerce as simple refresh everything works fine okay so guys in this video that's it and let's continue next video with the register and login module in the laravel 9 e-commerce tutorial so thank you for watching this video guys please subscribe like and share